What are these? Tools for Earning Survival Funds Darlings may freely enter and leave the experimental field and seize the manual identification tags tied to the monster's ankles. One metal tag can be exchanged for 200 bucks worth of survival funds. It's easy for you to say, this bunch of monsters don't eat humans, do they? They look like furious beasts. I think they definitely do eat humans. Bingo. The monster has already so stuffed that they've begun to prey on their companion. What do you think you are in their eyes? With these things present, even self-preservation would be difficult. Let alone seizing the tax. Abyss? Let's not take part in this competition for now. That rascal isn't. Headed down to seize the tags already, has he? This won't do. I've got to go and bring that rascal back. It's too dangerous. But... Even if I were to go over now, what can I do to help Abyss? I somehow feel that me going down there would be giving him more trouble. This is enough. No amount of lives would allow me to survive such a scare. Not to corrupt his behavior of going off on his own. Please don't get injured, Brad. Hey, Abyss, can you hear me? Mr. Wong, are you very worried about him? That younger brother of yours should find it pretty easy to deal with such things, right? Sister Mingyu seems to be paying special attention to my brother. No. Compared to A, I'm still more interested in you, Mr. Wang. You are different from everyone else prison. You look like you're very scared all the time, yet you also seem to fear nothing. Moreover, even a cold person like me would feel terrified for a long time after seeing those horrifying bodies. But you merely feel... Nauseous, that's all. I cannot understand your contradictions, so I'm very interested in you. Miss, it's not the best to take interest in another man. When your boyfriend is risking his life, is it? Hey, what about giving me the one that's dying? You're changing the subject again. <laughs> Why would I? Don't worry, Sister Mingyu. I'm very normal and I really want to live on too. 
But if you, if you wish to talk about why I don't feather corpses, it's probably because I have once held a body that was several hundred times more terrifying than the ones here. And cried for an entire night. Look, my boyfriend is awesome. Sorry, I can't really resonate with you on the topic of boyfriends. So many. You're giving everything to me? Alright, then we'll use these to buy delicious food and a big house tonight. But you must not be so impulsive next time. If something like this happens again, you must wait for me to think through everything thoroughly before you act. Hold on, this tag that you're wearing? Can I have a look at it? That's right, the name tag that the beast wears is the same material as the ones on the monsters. It seems that, like him, the group of monsters also came from Underground Research Institute. Abyss, can I exchange this tag on you for money too? No. Uh-huh, this rascal actually learned to reject? Only with it. Will I be me? Abyss has probably mistaken that dog tag as a symbol of his identity. In fact, 24-year-old Abyss also seemed to have this with him all the time. Don't worry. I won't take your stuff without giving anything in exchange. How about I trade with the necklace on my neck? This is Guan Yin pendant. It'll keep you safe. Only animals need to wear tags for identification. We're human. You decide the kind of life. That you want to have. What kind of person do you want to be when you grow up, Zixian? Wang Zixian, nine years old. I want to become a property tycoon like daddy. I want to develop many, many buildings. But that seems too simple. After all, I'm a lot smarter than daddy. Huh. 
Uh, then who should I become? Einstein? Bill Gates? <laughs> There's no need to become another person, is there? Daddy hopes that Zishin will just become himself. You decide the kind of life that you want to have. Hey Dad, what have you been up to these days? You don't go to the hospital and you don't pick up your calls? I know you're really suffering after being cheated and falling into bankruptcy, but mom's illness is really severe too. I'm almost at my living going back and forth between school and the hospital. Dad? Let's go. We'll go buy delicious food. It's been a long time since I've lived with such confidence. Abyss, today the both of us must squat our to our heart's content. Go ahead and pick what you want first. I'll go grab a shopping cart. Lucky D, your vital parts are fine, but this piece of clothing has to be discarded. Um, I was careless and didn't avoid the monster claw. These are shoes. I remember that Rascal Abyss hasn't had any shoes on this whole time. Yet it's old seven even tone. The toughness of his skin is amazing. But it's still unsafe to be without shoes. I'd better get him up here. This place doesn't do discounts. I can't believe that there isn't a single pair below 500 bucks. Mr. Wong, this is a little brusque, but are you interested in sharing an apartment? Sharing an apartment? Hmm. There is detail about the different types of accommodation on the poster over there. It's true. I was in such a hurry to pay for Abyss last time that I did not even notice that there was important information here. We almost ended up on the streets. Mr. Wang, I saw that you were feeling troubled over the prices of the shoes just now. A two-room apartment with a kitchen and a bathroom in the arena is a better deal than us getting an insuited each. Besides, we can also do our own cooking and save another sum of food. You mean the money saved from the rooms can go to the shoes? Yes, but whether to take it or not is on you. I just want to have a place to shower. Since you've kindly invited us. Uh, 
Why would we not agree? Looking forward to a pleasant cooperation. Uh, friends, you actually know how to cook? It didn't seem like it. Huh? What's there to seem like or not? The food will be ready in another 20 minutes. Get prepared. Alright, Mingyu is showering. I'll go get her. Hey, no stealing. Seriously, all of them are such a headache. Are you surprised? The beef from yesterday hasn't spoiled, so I specially cooked it for you. Quick, secretly finish it here. Given your frightening appetite, you definitely won't be able to eat your full if you eat with us. Window lights that can emit daylight. A bright and spacious room. There's also a big soft bed. Although the organizer is always cheating us, at least the things that we get after spending money are sustainable. Even though I'm not very sleepy, spawning out on such a bed is a luxury. Oh yes, I've got a gift for you. Open it and take a look. Lift the cover. These are shoes. I don't know where, whether you're used to wearing boots or not, but these are very warm. They also help prevent your feet from stepping onto sharp objects and getting injured. Why isn't he putting them on? Is he worried that his feet will dirty the shoes? This is an opportunity to take advantage of. Abyss, why don't I take you to go and have a shower first? That way, when you put them on afterwards, you won't get them dirty.
previously was extremely resistant to showering. I don't know if this trick would work. Hey, 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 take off your clothes first. Seriously, do you usually not shower? Showers are pretty cold. I hate them. Oh yes, it seems that he's always lived in the laboratory. I suddenly feel like a real jerk. Abyss, don't worry. I won't let you take cold showers anymore. If I get you to shower with me again, I'd be an idiot. That was too frightening. It was virtual you wore. You can eat bubbles too. Right now, I just want to quickly lie onto the bed, sleep, and get myself back into reality for some quick time. My mobile phone is indeed has no signal here, but the time displayed is the best time. I'll see if the photos taken here can be brought back to reality. After you have put your shoes on, Let go of me, I'm suffocating. This fellow is being too happy. You like it? If you feel happy because of the pair of shoes, it means you like it. Like anything expresses. This way, communication is created between people. I'd be able to understand your preferences even more quickly, too. Come, try saying you like this pair of shoes. Deja vu of teaching a child to speak. I Yes, yes, what's next? Like... Prince.
light prints. <sighs> I already said it's to express your liking for the shoes, not me. This is probably the sense of accomplishment of being a father. And back to reality again. Blood stains, so difficult to wash off.